Hey, um, a lot of people ask me where I get my daughter's bows, and I actually make them myself. So I wanted to help you guys learn how to make something like this. Oh, <laughs> like this. It's a little cute little bow. Um, it's about four and a half inches, which is a really good size. Um, not too big, not too big, or not too small. So what you're going to need is one and a half inch green ribbon, whichever color, whichever print. Um, a pair of sharp scissors, a uh, lighter for heat sealing, some thread, doesn't really matter what color, but don't use black because sometimes black shows through on the center part of a light color ribbon, like yellow, and a needle. So go ahead and thread your needle, like so, tie a little double knot on the bottom, and um, let's, after you do that, heat seal. <laughs> I've already done that part, but just like this with your lighter, do the ends so they don't fray. And you can cut these whichever way. If you want to cut up tails like this, or just like angles, it doesn't really matter because one only really one side is going to be showing. So that's it. So let me see if I can do it this way. This would probably be best for me to show you because you're looking like over my shoulder. All right. So take your ribbon like this and take the little tail part and you're going to want to flip that over like that okay that's going to create your first little loop so then you're going to take the other tail and you're going to bring that up and you're going to want to make that the same size okay then you're going to take this oops sorry <laughs> and you're going to tuck that guy under there like so and I'm going to bring this up and around. And see how that created like a little X? Next is the fold, which is the most important part. So, take your left hand, like the bottom part of the bow, and just kind of pinch that up and down. Can you see how I did that? Like up and down. And then just repeat doing those little pinched um, sections. So you have about three. So your bow looks like that. Okay? Then take your needle and just stick him right through the middle. And you want to make sure you get all of the ribbons. Stick it through like so. And then just wrap him around and not him. Just like that. And then you can just kind of fluff the sides and trim the tails if you don't like those showing or whatnot. And there you go, there's that part now. You got like a little bow going on? Now what I do is I cut like, here, I'll just use this pink. But instead of like buying, you can buy like the 3 8 or 5 8 the skinnier, um, depends how big you want your center. But the coordinating color that goes with this, you can buy the small one. But... I like to save money and just cut some like this, like two inches, and then cut that guy super skinny, like a quarter of an inch. Heat seal him like that, and then you're just going to tuck him around and glue him. I have a little bit of my string hanging out. And see, there you go. You have a little yellow bow. Let's just glue him on. I'm not going to glue him because I'm thinking about cutting this. But um, that's pretty much how you make your little boutique bow. Alright, I hope that that helps. If you have any questions, go ahead and comment below. And I will answer them as best as I can. Thanks, bye.